still here in Portugal and one thing we actually realized there are so many hidden gems of course I had to accentuate that all across Portugal that we felt it best to include that all in one video so let's not waste any more time let's go straight to the first location Praia do Camilo. So if you want to swim, chill, take it easy, you can come here and check it out. Be wise though, because if you look a little careful, I don't know whether that's dirt or algae or not, but I'll let you be the judge of that. There's a nice cave that you have access to right through the front over there. And I think there's like a little hut where you can get some food and drinks. So if that is your type of thing, then that comes highly recommended. Offwards, oh, onwards to the next spot. Alright guys, so up next we're here at the Marina de Albufeira. Now why are we here to specifically see, of course, the Benegal Caves, or as Shaq would actually put it, the Bengali Caves. Alright, so now to get there, obviously I, we can't swim there because I can't swim, or I can't even walk there being six foot three. So we're going to try and attempt to get a speedboat. This costs, give or take, about 29 euros. We're going to try and get it from Get Your Guide, not sponsored. So let's go jump in there and see our thoughts. trying to move this up and down. This is genuinely the waves right now. Oh, wait, we're we're actually up. getting a boat back to London, bro. <laughs> like, what are we doing? We have no idea where these caves are. Oh my god. What cave? Bro, <laughs> man don't see no cave, fam. Man just sees. <laughs> sees, isn't it? <laughs> what if it? you can see Shaq's death. Oh my, oh my days. God. Shaq's death grip right here is amazing. Shaq, how do you feel, mate? Fuck it, don't chat to me, bro. Don't, don't <laughs> chat to me, bro. <laughs> concentration is at the moment <laughs> and that was the actual speedboat now what are your final thoughts the one day we actually go um, the tides were so high and kind of shaky that we couldn't go into the caves and we didn't see any dolphins yeah. but the actual experience I thought was really good and had we been able to do those things would have been an absolute 10 out of 10 different experience for you to go on a speedboat oh, going yeah. extra fast him riding the waves like that it was mm. it was insane it was, to, experience. It was insane to say <laughs> the least yeah oh, my days. Bro, I have one hand like oh, shit <laughs> <laughs> a little salty because obviously we didn't go to the caves but it is what it is technically we did go to a cave not the cave not the bengali caves yeah Be benagil so that was albu Fira. let's see if we find a hidden gem hidden gem hidden gem hidden gem on to the next spot We are our next spot of the day. We are at Mira Duoro da Senora do Monte. Yeah, I've said it right, baby. Vibe smiling because you don't rate me in it. So this is known as one of the best viewpoints in Lisbon. Mira Duoro translating to viewpoints. So whenever you Google that, you know you're going to catch something naughty. You guys think it's a gem. I think it's a hidden gem. Put it down in the comments. Let me know what you think. But the fact that it's wheelchair accessible, and the views are just mad. I don't know what else to say, man. You just gotta check this place out. That's 
thing over there looks like the, the no map of Frost. Way. <laughs> no <laughs> We found it! We found Frost! <laughs> So we have got a hidden gem for you, right? We are Clerigos Church, okay? For a special event called Spiritus. Now this only runs during the summer months until October and is basically an immersive light show about the history of the church, okay? And it's known to be very beautiful. So tickets were about 14 euros per person, 12 euros if, you are, if they're discounted. So for example, if you're unemployed, uh, you're not working, you're disabled, etc. But this is a shout. Let's go. So we have just come out of the Spiritus immersive show and whoa, it was just, I know at the beginning it, when I intro this, I said it was, you know, a light show to reflect the history and culture of the church. I was slightly off on that one. What the artist was trying to um, impersonate was the traveling throughout time. Now, obviously, depending on how you see it, you may see and interpret it differently. I know for Mo, for example, he said he got some mad Assassin's Creed vibes. And if you've ever played the game, then you can understand why. For some others, it may be more of a spiritual journey, but the light show is, your eyes don't close. You're just fixated on the journey that the show creates. If you're coming to Porto from now to October, you defo got to check this place out and put it on your itinerary, man. It was well worth every cent. So for a next hidden gem, we're here in Porto. Now, would it even be a free man aboard video without a rooftop bar? So we're here sitting comfortably on the fourth floor of Hotel Vinci overlooking the Ponta de Arabida bridge. My goodness gracious, it provides ecstatic views, not far away from Riviera. It's about a 15 to 20 minute walk or a five minute car journey, but this is a place to be nice and relaxing. Not too many people to kind of overwhelm you. A vast variety of drinks and moderately priced as well. So for nice views, nice drinks, and just a general vibe, this is the place to be. We have about 20 minutes until that sunset and we want to get the perfect drone shots because you know it's all about the drone shots. So guys, this spot here, it's a hike to get to man. Mo will put it somewhere in the screen where we actually parked the car and started walking from. But the fact that no one's here and we're here and the view is this good, that's a hidden gem. No doubt about it. Not one person in sight, man. Yeah. Drone time. Yeah, drone time. everyone so that's gonna be it for the hidden gems video personally my favorite was the one viewpoint in Faro now that view was just breathtaking I can't say any more than that so hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you want us to make more hidden gems video let us know in the comments down below as always don't forget to like subscribe comment share smash the notification bell let us know what else you want to see and we will make it happen three man abroad out and peace <laughs>